Have you ever seen red envelopes like these? They appear in every Chinese community worldwide. Citibank and Bank of America give out red envelopes around Chinese New Year in late January or February. During Chinese New Year, Chinese children will bow to adults and say 恭喜 which means congratulations. Then the adults will give each of them a little money in a red envelope. Why do they say congratulations instead of Happy New Year? Because according to legend, a monster used to come out on Chinese New Year's Eve. The monster is scared of nothing but fire, noise, and the color red. So people will use red decorations for their houses, set off firecrackers, and say congratulations to each other on New Year's Day for their survival. Saying congratulations became a tradition, which remains today. In the distant past, Chinese New Year's money for children came as red strings of coins. The red color was meant to protect the children from the monster. Red envelopes were invented around the year 1900. During Chinese New Year, children are not the only ones getting red envelopes. Young adults may continue to receive them as long as they're single. Elderly people may receive money in red envelopes from their adult children, not only for Chinese New Year but also for their birthdays. Red envelopes for an elderly person's birthday party may have a special Chinese word printed on them. This word "show" means longevity. The use of red envelopes goes way beyond Chinese New Year. Chinese people think money is the most practical gift. The most common wedding gift in Chinese culture is money in red envelopes. The Chinese word "xi," which means double joy, is printed on red envelopes for weddings. Chinese people will also give money in red envelopes to one-month-old babies. To celebrate their new birth, Chinese companies give employees money in red envelopes to show appreciation for their hard work. Now you see how versatile red envelopes are. Perhaps you can use them too. Happy New Year!